Welcome to episode 25. As you'll remember, we had uh, 29 Studios' first networking event at the start of this month. Um, Ivdy was given the opportunity to do a 29 second pitch. Uh, James Kennedy from the Glasgow Care Foundation was the, the lucky winner and this week he's going to get a feature in the show. Now, the feature in the show will give Glasgow Care Foundation, uh, it will help raise awareness and give them some exposure. Um, James came in for a chat and if you watch the feature um, you'll get an idea about what James is doing and the Christmas campaign that they're running. So the Glasgow Care Foundation is the oldest charity in Glasgow that you've never heard of. We've been around for 150 odd years. So, so we're a charity that, that helps people in a, a different kind of way um, and we help the, the members of the poor in Glasgow who have had all the help they can get from government agencies and have nowhere else to turn to. There are still many, many more families that we could be helping um, and so we're always looking to try and raise awareness of what we do. One of the ways in which we, we see an opportunity is, is to invite people to become a, a friend of the charity um, and it's not, uh, we're not aiming for that to be a complicated thing. It's very simply follow us on social media, share what, what we publish, you know, and, and get involved and engaged um, with us. We've always collected toys around Christmas time and it started off quite small, you know, a couple of dozen toys and it's grown and grown and grown over the years to be hundreds and now we're into the thousands of toys that we, that we collect each year. Um, and these are for families that, that wouldn't ordinarily have a great Christmas. Um, and what we try to do is provide families that we're aware of and that the agencies we work with are aware of a brand new toy that they can open up on Christmas morning. So you'll find us at the glasgowcarefoundation.org and uh, you'll also find us on Facebook um, and on LinkedIn because we want to make sure that what we share is something memorable for people um, rather than just sharing any, anything at all. Well thank you very much for coming in today James um, and wish you all the success with your Christmas campaign. I hope you get all the presents and all the support you need to get from the Glasgow community and further afield. Thanks very much Gary, thank you. Welcome to Edinburgh on St Andrew's Night. Tonight we were invited along by the Innovation Academy to talk about global ambitions for young businesses and what better way to talk about 29 Studios and the journey we've been on for the last nine years. An incredible story we had, we shared some slides, we talked about our show and it was a great presentation. Very proud of the culture we've, we've embraced at 29 Studios and how uh, we talk about astronauts, we talk about NASA and how there's no, there's no barriers or boundaries in space and we want people in Scotland to believe that as the future of Scot Scottish business. So welcome to Edinburgh St Andrews night, what a great night the 29 has had. In 2017, we're opening our doors to six entrepreneurs. We're giving you the opportunity to come and um, have a desk space here at 29 Studios with the 29 Residency Programme. Uh, it's a great opportunity to come into what is a really creative space in the heart of Glasgow. Um, right in the city centre, you'll have a G1 postcode. You'll also benefit from uh, super fast Wi-Fi uh, and just a really creative environment um, where you, your ideas can just thrive. Inside 29 Studios itself, we've got a uh, plethora of spaces. If you've been here before, you'll know we've got the Pirate Bar, we've got the 29er space, we've got our studio, which is where the magic happens and we do all of our work. Uh, we've got a fully stocked kitchen area as well. If you're interested in becoming a 29 resident, then head to our website, 29studios.com forward slash residency. There's more information about the program itself, um, along with any information that you might need to know and an application form where you can submit your application as well. So it's been another exciting week here at 29 Studios and one of the highlights for me was on Tuesday night we were invited along to the soft launch of the opening of the Spanish Butcher, our next door neighbours here in Miller Street. Miller Street is really now turning into a bustling, vibrant uh, uh, street where you can have really great food and the Spanish Butcher is a welcome addition. So Jill and I were invited along by James and Lee's Rusk and we had a fantastic meal but more importantly customer service was at the heart of what they provided. We loved every minute of it and we'd just like to say thank you for inviting us and welcome to Miller Street.
So for the last month, me, Richie and Ellis have been growing these ridiculous tashies. It's all in the good name of Movember Foundation that supports men with me mental health problems and prostate cancer. So today's the big day and the tashies are coming off. It's a sad day. When's the best? I'll try my best. That's all that matters, he tried his best. So it's flat What, you don't cut yourself, Ellis? <laughs> I can feel the difference already. Oh, brand new. Final inspection just to see if it's yeah, gone. Well, yeah. Rich, have a wee, a wee tash check. You're stroking my lip. That's just, <laughs> so yeah, we're raising money for basically um, men's health, basically. Um, people with prostate cancer uh, and also men with mental health problems. So it's been a really great cause. Uh, we've raised, raised lots of money, uh, but there's still plenty of time to add more money to the fund. Uh, we'll put a wee link in the in the description below, but uh, I'm, I'm next. Let's see that noise. Oh. How's that? Right, going a Done. bit closer. Let's yeah. see Facebook Live. Approved. Uh, um. Jake, how does it feel? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll bring the ball over. Enjoyed having a moustache. What to wet up? It's actually grown on me, to be honest. Like, I think I'm ah. probably. <laughs> <laughs> no pun intended. <laughs>